My name is Bradley Ladwig and I'm the new appointment to the Palvert Chair in Energy Process Engineering here at the University of Luxembourg. Today I'd like to tell you a little bit about myself and especially about the work that we're going to do here together at the University of Luxembourg. So I come originally from Australia and I studied for my bachelor and PhD degrees in chemical engineering at the University of Queensland. After completing my studies, I had a very international career. Uh, I was first a postdoctoral researcher with the CNRS in France. Then I was an academic at Monash University in Melbourne in Australia. Then at uh, Imperial College London in the United Kingdom before most recently as a research group leader at the Karlsruhe Institute of Technology in Germany. So this um, international experience that I've had has taught me a few really important things. Firstly, I've loved being able to immerse myself in new cultures and get to know new places and new ways of working. Uh, I've learned some new languages along the way. But most importantly of all, I've had the ability to work in really diverse teams on very, very interesting and important research projects, quite large research projects. And really that has prepared me perfectly for what we're going to do here in the University of Luxembourg. And that is where we're tackling the biggest challenge that we have, which is our pathway to net zero. So we need to change everything about the way that we, we eat, the way we clothe ourselves, the way that we transport ourselves, the buildings we live in, the way we heat them, everything about the way that we use energy in our society. And a really key part of that change will be hydrogen. Of course, hydrogen can't give us the solutions to all of these challenges, but it will be really critical for some of them. And in particular, the chemicals industry, in manufacturing, um, in some transport applications and some heating applications. So this leads me into what we're going to do here at the university. So there will be two key focus areas. Uh, the first one is on advanced nanostructured materials. So we will uh, construct and set up completely new laboratories, state-of-the-art laboratories in a new building here at the Belleville campus of the University of Luxembourg. And in those labs, we will develop completely new materials for uh, production of hydrogen and especially storage and separation of hydrogen because these are really key technical uh, challenges that we need to solve. At the same time, I will work together with industry, with uh, funding bodies, with government, the local government, uh, national government, but also European bodies as well, to pursue very large projects where we bring together many different parties from research, industry, other parts of society, uh, so that we can really roll out hydrogen technologies in important applications. So these two focus areas together will help us really advance to accelerate the penetration of hydrogen technologies in industry and society to really help us achieve that very, very important goal to hit net zero. I want to say a particular thank you to the organisations and the bodies that have made this professorship possible. Of course, the university and the government of the Grand Duchy of Luxembourg for establishing this chair, uh, but in particular, the Paul Wurt company who have very generously sponsored this chair. Uh, together, that has given us the basis to set up a very substantial research team and very substantial projects right from the beginning. And I really look forward to working together with colleagues here in Luxembourg, in the greater region and right throughout Europe to really push ahead with hydrogen technology. I'm very thrilled to be starting this professorship now and be doing it here at the University of Luxembourg.